man, the market is absolutely flooded with new fishing products all the time. Different baits, lures, lines, rods, reels. Everybody has the new thing of, of what's going to catch more fish, but one thing that really hasn't changed that much that we all have to have is a hook. All of the baits these days still have hooks on them. Um, they have changed a lot, and I've gone a lot of different ways on what I actually like. You know, if you follow this much, you know I really like to flip, pitch, fish shallow cover, um, and, and I, I've experimented with all different kinds of fishing hooks out there, you know, from just the old offset worm bin to straight chain, offset, you know, even different types of trebles. I'm not gonna talk about those right now, but just different types of hook. And I think I finally got down to the type that is gonna work best for me. Um, I used to work with this right here. So this is your EWG. You see just an EWG flipping hook, or some people call it this, the heavier wire. And then there's, of course, the straight shank. It's got the keeper, a little bit different than the old school stuff. Um, now, I, I used to throw this EWG. It, I liked the way it sat on the bait. I liked the way it looked. And I didn't lose too many fish. But at a tournament earlier this year, actually at Harris Chain, um, I messed up and I lost way too many fish and I couldn't figure out what was going on. Um, I lost a lot of fish. And then I switched to, of course, the big, the beefy straight shank. Still super heavy wire. I have not lost fish on this. Um, other, you know, that I've, I've, I've lost some fish, but not none that I feel were the hook's fault. I will never flip another one of these EWG hooks. It will not happen. I won't do it. I'm straight, straight shank from here on out. And here's why. So I have some baits rigged up. Got some. Uh, this is this is what I flip primarily. It's a bio spawn vile crawl. So this is this is the vile crawl on the four. Both these are four rod EWG hook. Now look at this. Look, yeah, it's pretty. You know, real pretty. It's gonna go down through the cover. Nice. The bio spawn. Uh, the vile crawl has a hook slot on it. You can see that there. But here's the thing. When a fish eats this. Let's say this is the top of their mouth, you know, bottom top, and you set the hook. You know, obviously their mouth could compress that. Let's just say it, it compresses that. What I think happens a lot is you get just a skin hook. Because what I was noticing is a lot of the fish, the bigger fish were the ones I would lose, and I would get two or three cranks in on them. And I think it's because when I'd set the hook, you know, it was just skin hooking in their mouth. If you look at the look look at the the hook right here, the point compared to the eye, it's almost flat across there. So when you jerk, if you can see this or not, when you jerk, it doesn't have the opportunity to really dig in. It can just kind of it, yeah, it's gonna hook them, but it, it can get just kind of pierced into the skin there. Now, the, with the straight shank. Do you see? Now I'll rig, them, I'll rig them upside down with a straight shank. I have a different video on that. When you set the hook and that compresses, look at the angle of that. When you jerk, that's angled straight up into the roof of their mouth. Let me grab this other one and show you. Look at the angles. See how the straight shank is angled up? The wide gap is almost down, really. So that's gonna penetrate up. I think you skin hook them with these. That's why I like this one. Straight shank for me. Let me know what y'all think. For me, I don't think I'll ever flip another EWG. It's always gonna be a straight shank. You hit them, I think that hook drops straight up in the top of their mouth. I just personally, I don't lose hardly any fish. So I probably got a bunch of EWG if anybody wants some mail them to you but let me know what you guys think always uh throw me a comment down there let me know what you're using please subscribe i'll have some more like this and uh, like i said let me know what you guys think appreciate y'all watching check back next week thanks guys